The electricity running through this display panel is being produced by an internal combustion engine powered by methane gas coming from this methane digester, supplied by the manure from some 300 cows on the Morrisville State College dairy farm. The system generates $35,000 of electricity annually. Plus, the effluent can still be used to fertilize their crops. In fact, the treated manure can be stored and used when it'll be most useful. Being able to uh, uh, hold on to our um, effluent and then apply it when the plant can mostly use it. Um, what is the advantage there is the odor uh, issues. Uh, if you were to store uh, manure without being treated and then try to apply it on land one uh, during the summer, uh, then you cannot really have a, a problem with odors and uh, neighbors can complain and uh, this would be a way to reduce that. So essentially the treatment of the uh, manure in the system will help us in producing material that is not as offensive as otherwise. Is it worth the cost? The Morrisville State College methane digester cost about $900,000. A lot of farmers actually can justify the installation of the system is from the older uh, elements, uh, that is to try to reduce and cut down on the complaints about the farming. Uh, so that might be a justifiable way to put the system in place. But then having that additional component of producing electricity or, and uh, in this case, hot water, that could be another uh, element that could help offset the cost. They've been using the treated manure as fertilizer for the past two and a half years and acting dairy farm manager Doug True is pleased with the results. That works real well because we don't, we don't lose any of the nutrients.